Thank you, Andy. Tis the season for smartphones. Lots of new phones hitting the market this Lots. spring. Uh, but you have one that's standing out from the pack, and this is the new one from LG. This is the LG G5. I'm going to go and hold it up to you here. A very nice design. And I really like the latest trend, seems to be in smartphones, is curving the outside edges. So it feels really nice kind of when you cup it in your hand there. Yeah. This is a, a really slick device. I mean, processor's fast, there's the performance, no issues at all. But I really want to kind of focus on what sets this phone apart. If I turn it around, uh, there's not one, not two, but three cameras on this phone. Oh. And there's actually two rear cameras in the back. And you may wonder, well, why on earth would I need would I two need cameras three? in the back? Yeah. One is a standard camera, and one is a wide angle camera. Fancy. So you don't have to zoom in and out anymore. Is anyone gonna, else doing this? This is one of the first that I know of that has standard and wide. So I'm going to bring up some photos that I shot and just kind of give you an idea because the cool thing is uh, it's easy to switch it back and forth. So here is a standard shot. This is my son uh, just at the playground yesterday. This is the normal lens. Yeah. And if you take a look, that's the difference between the normal and the wide. Cool. You get a lot more of the picture Lots of with options. the wide. Mm -hmm. I'll show you another example here. You're just monkeying around. Had on a fun day. The, yeah, and then go for wide. Huge difference. I like that. Camera takes Big beautiful pictures. Uh, mm -hmm. And the nice thing is there's also some other modes uh, that actually shoot all the cameras at the same time. So this is called a pop-out. So the inside, the part that's in focus there, yes. is from the normal. The outside, which it's blurred, is from the wide-angle lens. So you can change that background. You can have the black background blurred if you want. You can have it not blurred. Mm -hmm. And so you can have a lot of fun with this. And you can actually change the shape of the pop-out as well. It's all built into the phone. You don't need software or anything. So you can just spend a day just having a blast testing all the features. There's slow-mo, you can do videos in this kind of format. There's even one mode where you can do three photos at the same time. You've got the two rear, and then it takes a photo of you at the same time as an inset. Oh, cool. So you capture all so three So no all additional apps. That's all within the camera. All built in within the camera itself. Cool. And the phone itself. Uh, now, this is also the first modular phone from LG. This is really neat. The idea is you can swap out components. Now, it's kind of limited what you can swap out, but there's an, actually a little button on the side. I'm going to turn it off here. Uh, and if you click it, see if I can do this. And you pull it out. So there's the there's battery. The battery. So if you want, you can actually pull out the battery. If it's dead, just give it a good yank. And there you go, swap out the battery. Okay. So that alone is beneficial, right? Mm -hmm. But there's also things that LG calls friends. So these are different modules that you can buy. So if I put the battery in the new module here yes. and put this in. Now what? Now what happens, this is called Cam Plus. Now I actually have physical controls for my camera. Oh, okay. So I can hold it like a camera, there's a zoom, there's the shutter button, there's a video, dedicated video button, and there's all the other friends as well. Uh, there is a virtual reality headset. That looks pretty sleek, actually, that as far as... virtual reality headset. That looks pretty sleek, actually, that, as far as virtual reality yeah, headsets that connects, go. Yeah, it's small, right? Mm -hmm. uh, connects to the bottom. There is also a 360 cam. Uh, there's different friends you can buy. This is, for the most part, all the friends. And that's kind of where the limitations are with this phone. There's only so many friends out there right now. LG hasn't said if they're going to make any more friends. Okay. They're relying on other third-party companies to create the devices for this phone. So while it's a lot of fun to play with the modules, there's only a few out there. If the companies don't come out with the modules, that's it. It's That's kind of it. dead in the and water. And those are add-on prices? Of course. The Where modules do we start? all... Okay, so the phone itself starts at $799.99 without a contract. Okay. If you get a contract, you can knock off probably about 500 bucks. Right. Uh, the phone comes out Friday, mm -hmm. so it's not even out available yet. And, of course, all your modules, your friends, as LG calls them, are going to cost extra. Those so my hope is it's a great phone, really slick features on there, especially the camera. It's a lot of fun. But there just needs... It needs to have a lot of friends. Without the friends, it's not going to succeed. So it's kind of a wait and see game. What's going to happen? But if you love it's taking pictures, kind of pictures, like a technology imitates life. Yeah, true. Uh, <laughs> but if you love taking pictures, I got to tell you, I had a blast. It's with for, the G5. Yeah, it's for someone who's a fan of photography. Exactly. Cool. Thanks very much, You're Mike. Welcome. Yeah, we like that. Uh, nicely done. The new LG phone available on Friday. Uh, still ahead on the show.